Just because you're a feminist doesn't mean you have to act like a man, my grandma Violet said in a voice that made me feel like I was 13 again, and she was lecturing me on boys before my first dance. I didn't listen then, and I wasn't going to listen now. Graham, it's different now. It's not like when you were young. Jenny, when I was your age, I had already been married to your grandfather for... She started, and I had to stop myself from throwing my phone across the room. The woman was 83 years old and had only been with one man her entire life. She met Gramps when she was 16, and they were together for over six decades before he passed just under six years ago. She never had to deal with texting and tinder and men who are terrified to even talk to you because they don't know the difference between flirting and sexual harassment. She never lived in a world where men refused to commit because they knew their next date was just a few taps on a phone away or had to compete for grandpa's attention with porn. She had no idea what it was like to be 39 and single again and terrified of being old and alone and... You have to make him chase you, Jenny, she said. And even though I knew she was trying to be kind, I felt this bubble of frustrated rage bursting up in my chest. And what came out of my mouth was, How? I practically yelled. Everyone always says that, but how, Graham? Ow. Your grandfather, she started, and I couldn't help it. I cried. Grandpa practically worshipped the ground Graham walked on. He was always doing little things for her, leaving her notes, talking about how beautiful she was to anyone who would listen, and he always seemed so happy whenever she was around. I was there at the hospital when he passed when he looked her in the eyes and whispered, I love you, with the last of his breath and died. Whenever anyone asked what she did to make him act that way, she would just smile with her eyes and say, I guess I just got lucky. What are you doing tonight? She asked, kind now because she heard my tears. I don't know, probably just Netflix. What about you? Are you playing cards or... Oh no, I have a date with this man who just moved into the complex. I think he's too young for me. He's only 72, but he's funny and he's got a nice body. And he keeps asking me out, so I figure why not? What about Jim? I asked about the man I thought was her boyfriend when she introduced me to him a week ago. Oh, him? We still spend time together, but I told him I wasn't interested in being tied down right now. Life is short. Okay, honey, I really do have to go. I love you, I said in something close to shock. I love you too, she said, and I could feel the warmth of her through the phone as I curled up in a ball on my bed and thought about Jeremy and the three months we spent together and cried. Jenny, I love you. I do, but I'm not in love with you. I don't know what it is. It is. I don't know what changed, but I just don't feel it the way I used to. I'm so sorry, he had said. And then he was gone, and then I was 39 and broken hearted and single and alone again, while my 83 year old grandmother spent time with her younger man. I thought about going back to Tinder and online dating and guys who play games and I wondered what I was doing so wrong. Three days later, we were at her place playing Rummy 500, and she was beating me the way she always did. No way, Graham, I said. No, no, not the cards, she said. Gambling is only fun when I think I might lose, and no offense, honey, but you're awful at this game, she said as she put down three jacks, three aces, and three kings. And then she asked me a question that felt like it came out of nowhere and made me feel a little nauseous and lonely just to think about it. Do you know how many more women there are than men in retirement communities like this? She asked. 
And I thought about it. I mean, women live a lot longer than men, so a lot, I guessed. A lot, she said. By the time you're my age, there's more than twice as many women as men. And most of the good ones are dating 10 or 20 years younger because with so few men around, they can get away with it. You tell me I never had to deal with dating because I'd only ever been with your grandpa and he treated me like a queen, she said. Did you ever think for a second that the reason he did that is because I knew what I was doing? She asked. Do you maybe wonder why it is that I have men chasing me in my 80s when most women my age know full well they're going to die alone with their cats? I love you, Jenny, and I'm not going to be around forever. I hate seeing you so sad when I know you don't have to be if you just get out of your way and let yourself act like a woman. So here's the bet, honey. You do what I say when it comes to dating and men for one month. You still have all that credit card debt, right? She asked. Yes, I said, feeling the weight of it on my chest suddenly. $12,471. I didn't think I could ever pay it off. You listen to me for one month, and if it's at the end of that time, you don't have this Jeremy guy or any other man you want ignoring other women and chasing you, then I'll pay off your whole debt for you. Can you afford that? I asked. Your grandfather left me very well taken care of, she said. You're going to get a lot of it in a few years anyway, but if I can't help you, if if I can't show you the truth about men and how they're the same now as they ever were, I'll give you enough for your credit cards now instead. Deal? She asked, thrusting her wrinkled, delicate hand toward me over the kitchen table. I thought about my credit card debt. I thought about Jeremy. I thought about the hell of online dating. I had nothing to lose. Deal. I said. We started that very afternoon. There's one incredibly important thing you need to understand about men if you ever want to find someone who treats you the way your grandpa did me. She said like she was teaching school again the way she did before she retired. I bit my tongue thinking she was going to say something dumb that I'd heard before. Something about how men need to hunt or how respect is more important to men than love is, or how the key is to act confident and be yourself. But then she told me something I hadn't really heard before, something I hadn't really ever even thought about before, something that, when I heard it, felt like dominoes slotting into place, finally explaining why every relationship I ever had had sputtered and stumbled and finally stopped, no matter how hard I tried to keep it going. If you want a man to chase you, and commit to you, and treat you like his queen the way your grandpa treated me, he has to believe with every fiber of his being that chasing you, choosing you, committing to you, your entire relationship is his idea. He has to believe with every fiber of his being that he is the one who made the first move. That he is the one who convinces you to be his girlfriend. And he is the one who begs you to be his wife. If you can do that, if you can convince him deep in his soul that you are a prize he worked for and earned, then he will love you and romance you and brag about you to his friends for as long as you want him to. I sat there stunned for a moment. I thought about the times I'd tried to guilt a guy I was dating into being my boyfriend. The times I'd put myself out there and only ended up with guys who were just looking for sex. I thought about Jeremy, I thought about my empty bed, I thought about being an old woman alone with her cats, I thought about my credit card bills, and then I looked at my grandmother in the eyes 
eyes and I asked her the most important question I could. How, Graham? I whispered. How? And then, over the next few weeks, she didn't just tell me, she showed me. And she changed my life, too. First, she taught me her thought magnet technique. It seemed weird at first. Just five words I could send over text or messenger, or even leave as a voicemail on his phone. I didn't think it was going to work, but it must have triggered something in his mind. Because the next day, he wrote asking me if I wanted to get coffee. I was so tempted when I got his message, but just like Grandma t- taught me, I told him I couldn't and that I wasn't ready to just be friends. I thought maybe that was going to be it. But the next day, he texted me again, sending fun, flirty messages, and he asked me about my day and told me he missed me, and it's like suddenly... It was the beginning again, like it was when we first met, when I first fell for him so hard. Thinking about you, beautiful, he'd say, and I'm so glad you're in my life. Eventually, I said yes when he asked me out. Grandma Violet told me exactly when I should. And I can't even tell you the joy I felt. When I saw the sparkle in his eyes as he looked me up and down, as I saw the hunger in him that had been missing for so long, that night we talked and cuddled. He held me in a way that felt like love instead of just lust. And the whole time we were together, I thought of what Grandma Violet had told me to do. I used everything she taught me about the masculine mind. And when we said goodbye that night, I let him kiss me. I wanted to dive right back head first in with Jeremy, but Grandma wouldn't let me. She said it would be good for my ego to have multiple men chasing me at once. And I have to admit she was right. I went on a few dates and I marveled with these men as they opened the door for me and acted like actual gentlemen. I even used a little trick of hers that requires nothing more than tilting your head just so, and suddenly I could get any guy I wanted in a bar to come and talk to me without them having any real idea that I was doing anything at all. It was fun being so wanted and romanced and pursued, but no matter who I went out with, I just kept thinking of Jeremy of the connection we had that I just couldn't feel with with anyone else. So I used a few of Grandma Violet's subtle tricks on him. And one day we were walking and holding hands and he pulled me close and looked me in the eyes and he asked me to be his and only his. And after acting like I wasn't thinking about it, I melted and said yes. And suddenly, he and I were a we again. And he's been chasing me ever since. Which should have made me happy. But suddenly, I was overwhelmed with this horrible feeling of guilt. I couldn't handle seeing so many of my friends struggling to find the love that I finally, finally had. I couldn't handle lying to my sister about what had transformed Jeremy. So, one by one, I started to share my grandmother's subtle psychological techniques and tricks with just a few of my friends. My best friend Sally, who hadn't had a boyfriend in four years since her ex broke her heart, hated the very idea of what I was telling her to do. But she did it anyway, and suddenly had not one, but two handsome, successful men hunting her with all the passion they could muster. My cousin Kim was seeing a guy who said he wasn't monogamous, but it took her just three days of grandma's advice before he begged her for a real commitment. My friend Kelly from the office said, Jenny, I swear your grandmother has saved my marriage. I can't believe what's come over Sam, but thank you. 
And over the next year, as woman after woman used my grandmother's subtle secrets to transform how men see them, to bring the spark back into the relationship that had grown cold, to have men chasing them now and forever while thinking it was 100% his idea. Well, eventually I ended up creating a handbook out of all of Violet's advice. A powerful little book full of all of her subtle tricks and psychological secrets and head turning techniques, which leads us here and leads us to now and leads me to asking you one very important question. Are you ready to give up what you think you know about men and learn the actual truth? Are you ready to be loved and even worshipped by a man in a way you never thought possible until now? Are you ready to have your pick of handsome, intelligent, Faithful men who brag constantly about what an amazing woman they have in their life. Are you ready to be pursued and romanced and seduced in a way you could barely even conceive of right now? Well, if you're still watching this video, it means the answer is yes, yes, yes. Which is why I'm giving you this one chance to change your life forever. By introducing you to an incredible handbook my grandma Violet and I decided to call Grandma's Subtle Secrets to Make Him Chase You Forever. Grandma's Subtle Secrets to Make Him Chase You Forever is an incredible collection of techniques and tools designed to make a man notice you even in a crowded room, talk to you even if he's shy, and pursue you and chase you for a as long as you want, while, and this is the important part, thinking it's 100% his idea and that he will stop at nothing to make you his and only his forever. In Grandma's Subtle Secrets to Make Him Chase You Forever, you'll discover what really goes through a man's mind when a woman makes the first move and how to use the subtle power of feminine coyness to awaken his hunter's instinct. So he feels an incredible compulsion to slay dragons and crawl across broken glass and do anything to have you in his arms, while thinking it's 100% his idea. And you'll learn the prince charming phrase to say to a man when he first asks you out to make it psychologically impossible for him to flake on you. These four simple words don't seem like much to me or you, but the moment he hears them, he'll know you're a once-in-a-lifetime woman who he needs to take seriously and treat like a queen. There's the five rules of sex every woman needs to know to awaken his hidden caveman lust. So he devours you you with his eyes, throws you over his shoulder, and ravishes you in a way you've been longing for your entire life, with passion he simply never had for any other woman. Also, why every woman has a Mona Lisa smile, and how to use yours to have men bending over backwards to open doors for you, help you with your groceries, and show you how chivalrous they can be while actually drawing jealous stares from every other woman who doesn't know this subtle secret or thinks there's something wrong with asking a man for help. Then there's how to use your eyes to let him know it's time to kiss you. And exactly how to melt into his arms and tilt your head when he pulls you close for a kiss to trigger his primal desire to protect you, to have you, you and to make you his and only his for as long as you'll let him. You'll learn the hot mirror technique to subtly teach a man what you want in bed without ever having to ask for it and without wounding his masculine pride by actually showing him. The four word text to send to a man once a week that sends testosterone thundering through his veins fills him with pride passion and intense desire for you and has him bragging to everyone he 
can at how astonishingly lucky he is to be your man. Also, why men lose interest in having sex with women they love, and how to use the light switch technique to reawaken the intense desire he had for you the very first time you were together. How to make him choose to quit watching porn without ever having to ask him to, and much, much more than I have time to really tell you here. But here's my promise to you. Just grab your copy of Grandma's Subtle Secrets to Make Him Chase You Forever, and you'll be amazed at how your entire relationship with men transforms overnight. In fact, if you're like a lot of women, you'll feel like you suddenly have a superpower, the power to attract any guy you want, the power to finally make that one guy you wanted so long, not just to notice you and not just want you, but actually need you and only you so deep in his bones that he will stop at nothing to treat you like the queen you are. The power to make a man not just chase you now, but chase you forever. So you become that one couple the passion never dies for. So you feel loved and desired now and for the rest of your life with a man who has earned your admiration and who will do everything in his power to keep you happy and safe. Honestly, I can't wait until you feel what it's like to finally feel safe in the game of love. To know with 100% certainty what men want. And to be one of very, very few women who know how to give it to them. To have men who ignored you before tripping over their words when talking to you. To finally have that one guy you wanted for so long finally look at you with absolute, overwhelming desire. To finally feel truly seen, wanted, and loved by a man in a way you might think is impossible now. To know, to truly know deep in your bones that you will never be alone again, unless you choose to, because you know the secrets most women never will. Can you feel that? Your heart beating? The dryness in your mouth, that incredible desire deep inside you to know this, to be able to do this, to have this power, to finally, truly stop feeling alone and scared, to feel pursued and loved and desired and chased by your man now and forever. How much is it worth to have this power at your fingertips? How much is it worth to never have to torture yourself on dating apps ever again? How much is it worth to never have to go on another disappointing date again? How much is it worth to feel loved and desired and safe? I don't want to bring you down here. But I see so many women every day in misery because they care more about being right when it comes to men than about being happy. They drag their boyfriends or husbands to couples counseling, which costs thousands of dollars and does absolutely nothing to give them the attention and connection and pleasure and desire that they crave so much. Or women who complain about being alone who spend so much money on dating sites and fancy clothes, but who just don't understand the truth about men that Grandma Violet has chosen to share with the world. So think about that for a second. Keep that solid in your head. What do you think would be a fair price for Grandma's subtle secrets to make him chase you forever? If you're being completely honest, I think you'd agree that $5,000 or more more would be totally fair to change your life with men forever. That's a lot of money to be sure. But when you think about it, it's nothing to finally have a real 
lasting, passionate love in your life. Heck, it's probably a lot less than you've spent so far trying to get this men part of your life figured out. But you know what? I'm a woman too, and I get it. I know that even when you want something so much and know it's a total steal at the tiny price you're paying, as a woman who spent so much of her life giving and giving and giving to others, as a woman, sometimes you just can't give yourself what you need, which is why I'm going to do something kind of risky here. Not a risk to you, but a big risk to me. See, my mission in life is to give regular women like you and me power. And if I have to take a hit to my pocketbook to accomplish that mission, that's just the way it is. If my story resonates with you, and if you're still watching this video, it means it does, then I feel like you and I are like sisters. So because you given me some of your precious time and because I can feel how much you want this and need this in your life, you're not going to pay $5,000. You're not going to pay $1,000. You're not going to pay $500. No, because you've stuck with me through this video, for you, I'm setting the price of grandma's subtle secrets to make him chase you forever at just one tiny payment of $97. And if you act right now, I'll give you a whopping 60% off, which means when you click the button below, you'll be able to transform your relationship with men and guarantee you will never be alone unless you want to be. For just one single payment of $37. And all you have to do to claim your incredible discount is click the big button you see below this video on your screen right now. Oh, and if you're not convinced yet, let me do one more thing to make this falling off the log easy for you. I want you to feel all the way deep in your bones that you're getting an incredible deal that you can be proud of. Honestly, I want you to feel like you're getting away with something here because I know that's the best way to guarantee you grab the program and get the incredible results we've talked about here. That's why I've got three very special gifts for you just for saying yes to Grandma's subtle secrets to make him chase you forever today. First, you'll get the special Four Magic Phrases That Heal Relationships report which turn conflicts into moments of growth in your relationship. So you'll know exactly what to say to heal and maintain long-term success in your love life. As a result, he'll see you as a woman of high value and become absolutely addicted to you. Your next present, gift number two, is called How to Have the Ultimate Love Life, where you'll hear from dating and relationships coach Marnie Kinries. This audio program teaches you how to use feminine emotional connection to wrap any man you want around your finger. You'll also discover the positive habits that must be cultivated for your relationship to succeed long term and how to have him always desiring you more, even after many years together. Your third gift is something quite incredible. In fact, I can't give this to everyone, but if you act right now, you'll also get gift number three, become his secret passion. How to fascinate a guy who thought he was not ready for a relationship. Once you unlock the secret method, he won't be able to stop thinking about you and he'll naturally want to take things to a deeper level of commitment. His instinct to be your hero will be ignited and he'll see you as a prize he wants to keep winning over and over. So let's add all of this up so you can see what an incredible deal you're getting. We've already agreed that Grandma's subtle secrets to make him chase you forever is worth at least $497 all by itself. And I can tell you after using these secrets myself, 
I would gladly have paid much more than that. With your special discount for sticking with me through this video, you are going to get the whole thing for just $37, which I think you agree is already insanely cheap. But then you're also getting the four magic phrases that heal relationships, how to have the ultimate love life, and become his secret passion, how to fascinate a guy who thought he was not ready for a relationship. And each of those could easily sell for at least $97 all by themselves too. If you were checking out at the supermarket, that would all add up to $688. But because I know what it feels like to be where you are right now, because I know what it's like to feel scared and alone, even when you're in a relationship, you're going to get everything I've talked about here, plus two other free bonuses I'm not going to tell you about here that are going to shock you for just one single payment of just $37. And because I want you to know that you can trust me and that I'm 100% on your side, I'm going to back up everything I've said with a truly astonishing guarantee. Here's how it works. Just click the button below this video and grab your copy of Grandma's Subtle Secrets to Make Him Chase You Forever right now. Use the material. It's so easy and done for you. See for yourself how powerful these incredible techniques and tricks are. Find out for yourself what it feels like to be truly pursued by strong, powerful, kind men, to have your pick of whatever man you want, to be chased now and forever because you've become an astonishing prize he simply can't do without. If you don't think the program is worth at least double what you're paying today, simply click Contact our customer service at email or whatever any time in the next 60 days. And you'll get back every dime just as fast as a credit card company will let us. Why am I being so generous? Because I really do want this for you. I want you to experience this power and pleasure. I want you to experience both the passion and the safety that come when you truly understand what men need. Okay, you're at a crossroads right now. And you really do just have two very different options, leading to two very different lives. Option one is to leave this page without grabbing the copy of the program we've especially set aside for you. I think you know what will happen if you do this. That heavy feeling in your heart. That sense that you made a mistake. Didn't take an opportunity you wanted so much. That feeling of helplessness because you feel so lost in the world of love and men and don't know how to get what you need so very, very much. I know you don't want that. I know you're sick of feeling alone and scared and having to be strong all the time when what you really want is to finally have that prince in your life you've been dreaming of since you were a little girl. Which is why, as your friend and someone who has been right where you are right now, I want you to take a deep breath and seriously consider taking option two. Just say yes right now. Say yes to being the chased instead of the chaser. Say yes to feeling feminine and powerful and desired. Say yes to being the woman men trip over themselves to be with, even if you're nowhere near 20 anymore, even if you've never felt truly feminine or wanted before. Click the button below, enter your payment information right now before life gets in the way, and enroll in Grandma's Subtle Secrets to Make Him Chase You Forever. 
with my 60-day guarantee, you're risking nothing. And with your special discount for sticking with me through this video today, you're getting an astonishing 60% off the already discounted price. In so many ways, I wish I was you right now. Because I know what's about to happen. I know how happy you're going to be when you see and feel what happens when you let your ego get out of the way and simply do what my grandma says. Thank you so much for your time. I hope deep in my heart that you take this tiny leap with me. I can't wait to hear about your success.